Dr. Suvachla, Scientific Director with Ziva Fertility Centers. How does thyroid affect male infertility? Does it? And is it related to more production or underproduction? There are many causes of male infertility and thyroid function or malfunction seems to be one of them. The thyroid gland affects almost all parts of the body and plays a very major part in growth and development of the human body. The secretion of its hormones regulates the metabolism and the ability to tolerate extreme temperatures, either heat or cold. Thyroid hormones act on testis in many ways. Excessive or deficient thyroid hormones affect the testis function, including abnormalities in semen. Hyperthyroidism, excess of thyroid hormones is usually associated with reduced semen volume and reduced sperm count, morphology and motility. Hypothyroidism which is underproduction or underactive thyroid hormones results in low sperm count, poor sperm quality, reduced testicular function and also unfortunately erectile dysfunction also. But the positive side is that all this can be treated and hypothyroidism is reversible with hormone replacement therapy. The free testosterone concentrations which are um, reduced in men with primary hypothyroidism can be normalized as in they can brought, be brought back to normal ranges with this treatment. Also when it comes to hyperthyroidism, anti-thyroid medication which uh, causes the thyroid to produce less hormones or radioactive iodine and surgery or also effective treatments to get back the thyroid function to normal. There are some food items which are a good source of iodine which are milk, cheese, uh, chicken, eggs, vitamin sources such as uh, vitamin B, zinc and selenium are also beneficial in improving hormone levels and thyroid functions therefore. However, you have to remember that too much iodine or vitamins in the body can also be problematic. Therefore, it is recommended that before you start any treatment or adding supplements, you should contact your doctor who will be able to recommend a required level of treatment to suit your body. One of the most important causes of hyperthyroidism in men is a condition known as Graves disease where a healthy thyroid gland is if you can say mistakenly attacked by the immune system which causes it to produce too much thyroid hormone now uh, this can also be because of consumption of too much iodine either it could be by medication containing iodine or from food and supplements now this may result in overproduction of thyroid hormones on the other hand a similar autoimmune disease occurs when the immune system mistakes the normal parts of the body as foreign invaders and attacks them blocking the thyroid stimulating hormone receptors and destroying the thyroid tissue this disease that usually causes hypothyroidism is hashimoto's disorder to understand this is because the body itself starts attacking ones that are you know good parts so uh, it, this is called as Hashimoto's uh, syndrome and some of the symptoms uh, of an underactive or hypothyroid problem in men are uh, tiredness or fatigue, uh, dry skin and nails that are you know breaking, feeling very cold, sometimes you could be depressed, uh, th there could be constipation in such patients, trouble with concentration so they have a hard time to concentrate on something for too long, gaining too much weight pain in muscles for no reason at all no no over exertion but there is always some pain so that those are the symptoms but when the thyroid is overactive or it is called as hyperthyroidism there are some symptoms that you should be watching out for swelling of the thyroid gland called goiter so it's right in front so when there is a um, uh, you know swelling it's called thyroid gland also swells up and it's, this is called as goiter feeling very hot and sweaty this is also one of the symptoms you may have warm skin that may be very itchy there could be anxiety or uh, moodiness there could be hand tremors or irregular heartbeat or there could also be trouble with breathing when you are still at rest there could be weight loss frequent or sometimes loose bowel movements, brittle hair or premature balding is also one of the symptoms. While many studies are still underway to prove that male fertility can definitely be caused by thyroid malfunction, it is uh, still advisable that thyroid function test should be a part of the diagnostic workup if a man is found to be infertile. This is a very simple test which is performed by way of a routine blood test and if it is hyper or hypo, medications can be started and therefore these effects can be reversed. If you want to understand more about 
thyroid issues and male infertility please feel free to contact us thank you a lot of effort has gone into making this video please like and subscribe us thank you